some sort of weird story going around the internet regarding my husband. The headlines were everywhere, the tabloids, the newspapers, credible news sources were talking about this affair. Sharina Hudson warns Wendy Williams to sue her. When Audacity was being distributed as a personality trait, Kevin and Sharina were first in line. You took the woman's husband, tore apart her marriage, and you want her to take care of you? That's more than audacity. Is Sharina warning Wendy that she will sue her? Before I go into the details, click the subscribe button so you never miss out on a video when it's being posted. Sharina attacks Wendy on social media. Wendy Williams has been ripped apart by her ex-husband Kevin Hunter's baby mama in a head-turning post on social media. Sharina Hudson threw plenty of shade to the former daytime talk show's way in an Instagram story. Happy and healthy is all I'm on right now, Sharina37 wrote in the post. She then added, the clickbait is real, I guess they need the storyline to continue for the podcast. Wendy previously claimed that she is launching a podcast, however, it is not clear if any episodes have been taped. Sharina has not added any further explanation as to what the storyline in her comments were touching on. Wendy claps back. Williams was the subject of a Lifetime biopic titled Wendy Williams The Movie as well as a tell-all documentary, What a Mess, in which she told all about her personal and professional life. A big part of Williams' story is her ex-husband's alleged 15-year affair with Hudson. In the What a Mess documentary, Wendy said TV and radio personality Charlemagne introduced her ex-husband to mistress Sharina Hudson. Hudson later gave birth to a daughter named Journey. Wendy found out about the pregnancy after she hired a private investigator to follow her ex and his girlfriend. She divorced Hunter in 2020 after 22 years of marriage. Williams described Hudson as less than smart, but she appears to have some business ventures in the works. According to her Instagram page, Hudson now describes herself as a fashion designer for Vish New York, as well as a vegan guru and chef at an upcoming vegan nose breakfast eatery. Bringing delicious plant-based pancakes and raw creamy shea butter, a tease for the eatery which is coming soon, reads on Instagram. The apparent rebranding comes after Williams had some harsh words to say about Hunter's girlfriend. In an interview on Watch What Happens Live, Williams called her ex-husband's mistress less than smart, and she shaded her past career as a bottle service girl at a club. She was one of those less than smart women who moved to the big city with bright lights and she wanted to be a model, the talk show host said, per OK Magazine. You know how the girls with the sparkling champagne bottles are at the club, they get people to spend more money, they dress scantily clad and things like that? Williams added that she knew about Hunter's affair with Hudson early on and noted that her husband's wannabe model mistress was disrespectful to her, yet once she had the nerve to say she admires her. Williams is unsure if Hunter and Hudson are still together, but she gave them a dual shout-out. At one point when asked if Hudson and Hunter are still together, Williams admitted she doesn't know if they're still a romantic couple. She noted that their child will soon have a birthday. I have no idea, Williams replied when asked about the relationship status, and I don't know how they're raising their daughter Journey. I think she's like two next month or something. That's not my problem. My alimony for all three of them is on time every month. Are they still together? So anyway uh, I have no idea. I mean, I, and I, I don't know how they're raising the daughter journey, who's almost two years. I think she's two, like next month or something. Wow. Um, that's not my problem. No, I know that sure my isn't. child, <laughs> my my alimony for all three of them is on time every month. Very good. Hunter was recently pictured on vacation with Hudson. Williams shaded the duo on her talk show while promoting her tell-all documentary. In a shocking Hot Topic segment on her show, she directly addressed Hudson and Hunter and name-checked their toddler daughter. I can't believe how fearless I am, and I can't believe how many people have been drawn into my situation over the 12 years that I have been entertaining you on television," Williams said per a video shared by ET Canada. Welcome to Hot Topics, Sharina Hudson, getting out of my car with my money. Good morning, Journey. I think she'll almost be three next month. Don't you know? Good morning, Kevin. Welcome to Hot Topics, Sharina Hudson. <laughs> getting out of my car with my money. Oh. Good morning, Journey. She'll be almost, I think she'll be three next month, don't you know? Good morning, Kelvin.
Even William's executive producer was stunned by her mic drop as she outed her ex-husband's mistress name publicly for the first time. In an interview on Out Loud with Claudia Jordan, Williams said her ex, who was fired as a producer on her show, has one job now when it comes to his young daughter. Kevin's got one job, keep her off the pole and hopefully she'll be more educated than her mother and father, she said in her per capital extra. Kevin has taken Wendy to court. All this comes after Wendy's ex-husband Kevin, who had an alleged affair with Sharina while still married to the former TV star, claims he's broke. In a court filing exclusively obtained by the U.S. Sun, Kevin claims that his monthly payments, which were made by the star as agreed to in their divorce, suddenly stopped in February of 2022. Kevin asked that the court order Wendy's guardian to make payments as contractually required under the MSA and severance agreement. As the U.S. Sun first exclusively reported, Wendy was placed in a financial guardianship earlier this year. In his filing, Kevin expressed that he depends on those payments, which were agreed to in their marital settlement agreement, to live. I've fallen behind on most of my bills. I currently live in a community that requires payments to the Homeowners Association, and I'm behind on that bill, Kevin shared. If the Homeowners Association fees are not paid, foreclosure will soon follow. Kevin told the court about the home he shares with Sharina and their love child. He continued in the filing, my car insurance hasn't been paid as a result of not receiving monthly severance payments. I'm behind on credit card payments because I have no money since the severance payments were suspended. My life has been greatly affected since the plaintiff stopped making payments under our settlement agreement. Kevin also claims that he doesn't have health insurance, which has created a burden since he needs hip surgery. Wendy's Drama in pushing back on Kevin's demand for payment, it was revealed that the former TV personality's attorney filed that she has not had any income from The Wendy Williams Show since October of 2021, just one month into what would be an entire season of the show going on in her absence. Wendy was reportedly making $10 million a year, or $55,000 an episode, for The Wendy Williams Show. The mom of one was absent for the entirety of her final season of her popular program as she battled a myriad of health issues, including Graves' disease, lymphedema, and substance abuse. Her longtime production company, Debmar Mercury, announced that her show was officially canceled earlier this summer and that Wendy's slot would be going to her former guest, Sherry Shepard. Wendy and Kevin share son Kevin Jr., 22, while he and Sharina are also parents to a young daughter. Kevin also tried to sue Wendy's production company. A source exclusively said that Kevin and Sharina are going strong, despite recent revelations that Wendy's ex has been helping her and their son, Kevin Hunter Jr., 21, navigate her care while she recovers from various health crises in Florida. Wendy has been living with family in nearby Miami, and her and Kevin's son has been navigating having power of attorney in place to help him care for his mother. In the wake of the Wendy Williams show being canceled last month, it was revealed that Kevin filed a $10 million lawsuit against Debmar Mercury, the production company for the Wendy Williams show. What was the lawsuit about? In the suit, the father of two alleged that he was wrongfully terminated. Kevin explains Ira Bernstein and Mord Marcus founded Debmar Mercury in 2004, and three years later the company began negotiations with both him and Wendy for a six-week trial for a talk show. The program would eventually become Wendy's massively popular daytime talk show. The suit reads, Kevin was used to being behind the scenes of Williams' prior ventures and used his business knowledge and street smarts to negotiate a significant financial increase from the initial contract being offered to Williams. It continued, the Wendy Williams show dominated the 10 a.m. daily morning time slot, and to date, no network has been able to beat the show at this time slot. Wendy's ex-husband is said to have been a vital part of the show's success, serving as the executive producer from 2007 until 2019. However, he was asked to exit the show after Wendy filed for divorce due to him having an alleged affair with his now second baby mama, Sharina, and having a child. Was he wrongfully fired? In the suit, Kevin says he was wrongfully fired. The termination of Kevin was based strictly upon his marital status and his impending divorce to the show's host, ignoring all the contributions that Kevin made to the show's success. Kevin claims in the suit that he was behind popular segments like Hot Topics and Shoe Cam and created marketing plans, among other things. According to Kevin, he believes the show wasn't as successful upon his departure and he is looking for a 7 to 10 million in damages.
What's their relationship like now? Sources previously said that while Kevin and the former Wendy Williams show host are on friendly terms these days, that doesn't mean that they're together. As one source exclusively explained, Kevin has been supportive of her and is helping her, but it's not true that they are getting back together. Kevin, who was Wendy's manager throughout her career until their divorce in 2019, doesn't get too involved in Wendy's care because he has his whole other life, but for the sake of their son, he is helping her and helping Kevin Jr. navigate what Wendy needs to do on a day-to-day -day basis. Kevin Jr. may have the power of attorney, but his dad is helping him manage what that means and what he needs to do. He's young, he's in college. Because of where her son is in life, Wendy isn't opposed to having her ex-husband help her along the way. Kevin has been seen out and about with his new bae. Kevin was spotted out with Sharina Hudson and their daughter amid speculation he was back with his ex-wife. Kevin Hunter was spotted out with his alleged mistress, Sharina Hudson. The twin 49 was also spotted holding hands with his three-year-old daughter with Sharina as they ran errands. A source said that despite the former couple being on good terms, they are not back together. Kevin Jr. has the power of attorney, but his dad is helping him manage what that means and what he needs to do. He's young, he's in college, and because of where her son is in life, Wendy isn't opposed to having her ex-husband help her along the way. Wendy Williams is currently staying with family in Miami as she recovers. The source also added that Kevin wasn't as close to Wendy as before. He doesn't get too involved in Wendy's care because he has his whole other life, but for the sake of their son, he is helping her and helping Kevin Jr. navigate what what Wendy needs to do on a day-to-day -day basis. Sharina has yet to comment on Kevin's current relationship with his ex-wife. Kevin's suit against the production company states, the termination of Kevin was based strictly upon his marital status and his impending divorce to the show's host, ignoring all of the contributions that Kevin made to make the show a success. Kevin claims to be behind popular segments on the show like Shoe Cam, Hot Topics, and other marketing plans that made the show successful. Wendy loves gossip, but I don't think she's deserved this. Let's wrap up. Do you think Wendy should sue them? Do you think she should just pay up since Kevin helped with her career? Tell us below. That's it for today, guys. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. See you next time.